Namaste friends and that's from Neek Vig right in front of you. And friends here I shall be telling you about the importance of food therapy. Now friends you got to understand that the underlying principle of food therapy is that whatever food you eat is either good or bad for your system. There is not even one food stuff on this planet earth which has a neutral effect as it enters your system. Many a times, you know, friends, I see people coming to me and uh, when I come to know about their diet, their diet is just the opposite of what they should be eating. They tell me, sir, I've been suffering from cancer and this is all what I've been eating. And when I come to know that what they've been eating, to my surprise, they've been eating all those stuffs which are going to increase cancer in their body. Similarly, it's with other ailments like high BP, diabetes, asthma and many others. So friends, you got to understand that food therapy is a complete science in itself and it is helpful in the treatment of several ailments like cancer, diabetes, high BP, blockages in arteries, cardiovascular diseases, liver disorders, kidney disorders and several others. I have written a couple of books on food therapy and on pranayama. One of my very favorite books is uh, The Miracles of Food Therapy and the Healing Power of Fruits. Now friends, you got to remember that you got to take in a diet which is loaded with antioxidants. Antioxidants are our best friends as far as the healing process goes. They are the free radical scavengers. Antioxidants are the one with work who work synergistically with a telescopic eye and their work is to get rid of the free radicals present in our system. Free radicals are our worst enemies as far as the healing goes because they are the ones who are the main culprit behind the cellular related or the degenerative diseases. Now there are many causes of free radicals like trans fats, uh, processed foodstuffs, pollution, uh, bakery products who have uh, which have margarine present in them uh, and most importantly I would say stress and anger which are one of the biggest causes of free radicals. Now antioxidants being our best friends we've got to take in a diet which is loaded with a variety of antioxidants. Again you got to take in a diet which is very nutritious, very wholesome and very very natural. Remember to go natural is the best rule. That is the thumb rule. You got to go natural. So try to take in lots of fresh fruits, lots of fresh vegetables, lots of nuts and seeds, wheat grass, juices. They are excellent for our system. And avoid all trans fats, avoid all processed foodstuffs, all uh, aerated drinks, avoid all stale food products. So friends, be very cautious of your diet and I'm sure you're going to, you're going to enjoy great health. So namaste friends, do take care and have a nice day ahead.